Being long time boaters, we've collected magma grills. Their biggest drawback is they are too hot and tend to burn food. This regulator lets you reduce the heat and cook your grilled food more slowly. It works. Buy it if you have a magma grill. They don't float. If you use your grill with it hanging over the side rail of your boat, it is only a matter of time before this DATMN thing will fall off. The regulator comes out pretty easy when you are adjusting the grill position. Better find a way to tether it to something, or you'll be buying these often works great and I like the design much better than the one on my previous marine grill. It is clearly marked. My old one. You never knew if you were on high or low or what. I kept the barbecue from my boat when sold, but mistakenly didn't keep the regulator and any cables that were aboard. So needed to buy a new regulator in order to use the small propane canisters. This is working great with my magma grill, and we've been able to grill out now that we have a mount for the grill. All is working well. I bought an open box grill and needed the regulator this is the direct factory replacement. There are several different magma regulators so make sure you get the right one for the right grill. This low flow valve puts out plenty of heat to cook with. Even in windy conditions it has not blown out. Since this is low flow it takes a bit longer before I can't hit the igniter to start the flame. Called magma to make sure this is the correct output for my cabo grill. Low output is definitely not enough despite their recommendation. Now I am stuck with a $38 part.